what's up what's up what's going on guys all right so uh monday nba slate for fendo we have about what is seven games slate which is better than 11 or 13 so it's good to see but before we do let's see what's going on with this slate right now man um man yep uh <laughs> hey man uh I, I, I like Giddy. Uh, first of all, he wasn't even doing good. I mean, let, let's look at the winning lineup. First of all, he wasn't even doing good. All right, so uh, let's check on winning lineup. Currently, three, six. So Giddy wasn't even doing good, but then he got hurt. That's definitely hurt. I mean, it hurt me everywhere. Uh, hurt me here. Hurt, I didn't play DK. Hurt me on uh, Price Peaks. Hurt me on this new website I'm trying. Oh man, that new website that last two plays on the Pittsburgh still has cost me 4K. I was in first. I was tied for three spots. All the offense I had to do. Is, uh, anyway, I don't want to talk about it. This is basketball. Anyway, so the winning card, winning lineup right now is uh, believe it or not, Labert is in the winning lineup. So it's good to see because I was very disappointed on how I was doing. And Keegan Murray, what happened, man? This guy was doing good in the first half. <coughs> Only finished with 21.8, and I have him in a lot of lineups. I'm talking about, like, I think I have 14 lineups, and I have, like, 10 of 14. Not good. But as you can see, this guy is winning, and he had uh, Cameron Johnson in there, and he also had Kerry Slaver. Uh, let's see, the guy... I think that guy gonna pass him because that guy has Marcus Morris and let's see this one. They probably have the same player. Let's see. No. Yeah, this guy gonna win. Booker. Yeah, he definitely gonna win. So this guy in third place. I go ahead and give him the 4K right now. All right. I mean 40K. Oof, I said 4K. Uh, yeah. So Fox. I make some switches here. I'd end up, uh, where is it? Where is it? I end up taking two guys out, which, man, I should have left them in there. I take CP3 out and uh, pull. I, I'm not sure how pull is doing. I know CP3 is not doing too bad right now, but I'm not sure how, what pull end up with. But I know he end up with more than, I think, more than 30. So and I end up doing this switch because. Uh, I saw him starting since, you know, I saw Truman starting. I said, let me go ahead and put him in there. And Fax was boarding. I mean, he ended up doing good, but uh, the fact that uh, he was a blowout, then they ended up putting him later, but still. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so Dots had like 30 in the third quarter, so I don't know what happened. So I'm not sure what happened here. Uh, Mark Kinnan, man, beast. And the bill had like 29 in the first half, only six cents. So, as you can see, he's not even currently in the winning lineup right now. It looks like he was on his way at 3.8%. All right, so let's look at the next slate. So, uh, Andy Philly, man. Philly's 0-3. This is a game I think they're going to win. So, uh, Philly. Uh, Joel Embiid, 10.3K. I think that's a great price. Uh, had a great game last game. The two before wasn't really too good. Harden is back to what? <laughs> back to 10K. Uh, I like him, uh, especially against Andy. How? Because of how Philly has been playing, I definitely see this game can stay close. Ali Burton, uh, as you can see, average 47, 39, 8.5. Uh, and I don't even think he averaged 35 minutes a game. Tyrese Maxey, 6.5. I actually like him uh, at 6.5. Tobias is also in play. Jalen Smith went off. Uh, so, Marston is still going to be out. So, give me some Jalen Smith here. Uh, body high 5.6. So far, I've been disappointed. I think he's so far I've been disappointed, but I do like uh Benedict on showing here. Uh, body here is a no for me. I would rather play uh Benedict. Uh, go go definitely in play if uh, go go definitely in play here. Go go be that say that's it. Uh, at 4.5k. Uh, Terry Taylor is a no for me. The fact that he's not starting. Uh, no to talk here, yeah? and that's it, man. No 
Nismith, no name board. All right, that's it. I'm not paying anybody else down here. All right, on Miami. So for Miami, I'm playing Bama 727K. I've been disappointed at the price went up, but I'm very disappointed so far. Jimmy Butler, great price. Uh, they just played Miami in Miami, and this game is also at Miami. I'm surprised because usually it's you see one game at the other team court, and then the next one. Uh, if uh, you know, so I was surprised. I thought this game would be in Toronto, but regardless. In this game, definitely, uh, believe it or not, Pascal is not my favorite player here. It's actually even Fleet and Jimmy Butler. Uh, but I do like Pascal. As you guys can see, this guy's been boarding. I do like Pascal. Even the last game, he only had like 10 in the first half, end up with 50, which is crazy. So, Siak, give me some Siakam, Butler, Bam, Bam Fleet. Uh, if Bond sees out, then. Uh, giving me I like OG. If Bam is out, then I like Trent here. Calori. Uh, I would say Van Fleet, Calori, and Jimmy Butler are my favorite three players here. Uh, I do like Max Schultz. Hello. Nah, I'm not playing anybody down there. I left somebody out and somebody else started. So we'll see. For example, if Bunch is out and then they end up putting Precious in the same lineup, I can see me go there. All right, so uh, for New York game, Rendo 7.9k, cheap price, even uh, blowout. So that's why, you know, sometimes blowout, you, you cannot really see that here. But yeah, Bencho, man, I, I got to get to him, you know. Uh, I didn't play him only in the first game, but I'm definitely going to play him at 7.5k. Bonson, I love Bonson here against Orlando. Uh, in this game, I would say, uh, you know, I, I think I'm going to get my three favorite players in this game is uh, RJ. RJ is cheap, 6.3K. So I like RJ here, even though he hasn't really been doing good. But my favorite three players is possibly Bonson, Benchero, and Rando. All right, but I do like uh, RJ here. Uh, Mitchell Robinson, it doesn't look like they want to play him. They would rather play uh, Hardenstein. So Hardenstein is another player I like here. All right. So uh, Reddish, I don't mind Reddish, man. Reddish need to take over for Fournier. Uh, that's it on this team. Let's go to Boston, Chicago. Levine came back and... He did really good. Uh, uh, he played way more minutes than I thought he would play. 38 minutes. I mean, 28 minutes. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, but, uh, yeah. My favorite player here is Busevich. Levine at 7.2K. And which is crazy, offered at 5.6K. Yeah, I think this is going to be the game where you're going to go by 25 fantasy points. So I do like him here. I do like Jalen Brown at 8.2k. I don't mind going there, but I'm giving you guys my favorite two play on every uh, game. So Tatum 10.5k. He has been doing his thing for average 55, 10.5k. So you have to put him in there, even though I, I might not play him, but you have to put him in there. I'm not trying to play anybody. Demar Derozan with uh, Levine, who I was labeled as a selfish player. He's actually much better than he used to be. Uh, because of that, I don't know if I want to spend 9.2k on the Mar here. Um, who else? Derek White, man, 4.8k, man. I played him the first game. I didn't play the second game or the third game. The third game, I, ne I just didn't think he would be playing that many minutes because he played 24-24. The only reason I didn't play him because of his minutes. All right. So no, actually, I did play him in the first and second game. Just the third, I didn't play him. Grant Williams is in play for me. And uh, Caruso is a no. Uh, that's it. Utah Houston. Yeah, you know I'm gonna play somebody here. All right. Uh, Utah Houston. So uh, who I like here? I like Lloyd McKinnon, uh, Kevin Porter, even Conley at six point five. I like Jordan Clarkson six point four, Jalen Green six point three k, uh, Jabari Smith six six k. Uh, 
send gun and it's not gonna start i like send gun here it's a no on sex then kelly oh definitely and gawubo that's the players i like here all right those players now who's my favorite player in there which is crazy gawuba is one of them one of the three players all of them basically from that utah team and Laurie Markkinen, and then actually have Laurie Markkinen, and even though I like Sand Gunman, I gotta put Kelly Olinik in front of him for right now because they could just, you never know, might not even play him that many minutes because of his defense. Let's see, 22 minutes. If you guy get minutes, whew, he'll be on all the winning lineups. All right, so for Brooklyn Memphis. Ja is in play for me, and I like Ja. I think I will take Ja over KD. Uh, Kyrie hasn't really had a good game, but I do like him at that price. Nah, I, I wouldn't say I like him, but he's okay. Uh, ben Simmons, 6 met 4K. Uh, is he play, finally played 30 minutes? I do like Ben Simmons here. Uh, Clarkson is in play for me. Uh, you know, the only problem is minutes. Sometimes he will get him, sometimes he doesn't. I think the coach go by the flow of the game. If he's doing good, then they're going to leave him. Uh, also, he'll definitely be, especially on FD, where he's going to give you some, you know, block, steal, those things count for three points, so always in play. I know Santi didn't have a good game last game, but I like him in this game. Concha is a no for me, because I believe Books will be back. Um... That's basically it. As far as the players out, my top two players in this game, which I really like, it's Ben Simmons. I will put uh, Sensi in there at 4.4K. His price go down. He's at two. And then the third one, let's go up. I will go with uh, Ja. You know something? If Books is back, I, I would go with KD. It is cheaper anyway, so all right. So, uh, Spurs against the Minnesota Timberwolves. So, uh, Gobert has been doing his thing 9.1k disposition. I don't mind him, but most likely I won't play him because of the position 9.1k. Towns is a no for me, just like he wasn't for me. So, Town is a no. Edwards, yes, I like Edwards here. Uh, Kelden is in play, Warsaw. Is in play, but I would rather play Keldon. Uh, Jacob uh, is in play, and Vasso is doing good. So Vasso, Trey Jones, all those guys are in play. Then McDaniel's gonna see a lot of minutes for that. Is in play, uh, 4.5. Jalen Noel cannot go wrong with that. And uh, Josh Richardson get minutes last game. The thing is, you just don't know if back when this guy gonna get some. Oh, that was the second game when he was for 30. So he, for now, he is in play for sure because of what he can do uh, at 4.1k. But my favorite three play here is uh, Edwards. Uh, I wanna go with Kellen Johnson, but I will go with Vaso here. I mean Vaso and Trey Jones. And then last game, of course, is uh, Denver and Portland. Uh, Joe Gillette went 2k. <sighs> Most likely, Joe K is not gonna make it in the winning lineup, even if he scored 50 points. All right, so Lillard 8.8k, uh, Nurkic 6.7k. Uh, I like Joe Cage is okay, but most likely, I'm gonna X him out. Uh, Lillard is in play for me. Grant 6.5k, Siemens. I'm not nah. I already played Josh Hart here. Michael Porter is in play for me. Uh, Jimmy Moore, the price is actually good. And uh, let's see how many minutes he played last game. 27. Yeah, so I you never see. I like Jim Moore here at at uh, that price, 5.5K. Uh, KCP is in play. Winslow, no, not enough minutes. Bruce Brown, unless if he start. And that's basically it as far as the guys that's in play for me. Uh, as far as my favorite three play here, it's uh, definitely Josh Hart, Porter, and Jim Moore. Jim All right, those are my favorite three play. All right, now as far as my 
three chord chip and the star i'm just gonna go ahead and go with uh, kelly as my chip play all right kelly oh on the 5.5 k so let's put him in the center for right now kelly O as my chip play like i said uh you stun they would i mean they're playing you stun i don't should be able to do his thing here so i'll i'll have me some kelly O here let's go ahead and uh, talk about uh what is it uh all right so my first call play all right i'm looking at my lineup real quick my notes real quick uh anyway man if let's check kelly how many minutes he played tonight he played 37 but the game did go to ot so uh but yeah all right so the next one oh let me go to call play so i'm gonna did i even talk about this guy because he's a call for me anyway so i'm let's go back to miami man i, I don't remember i talk about him miami uh which is i'm talking about of course hero i like hero here all right but i'm gonna go ahead and go with lowry i'm gonna go with lowry here at 5.3k you know uh, 5.3k against toronto i wish this game was toronto but early in, it's early lowry is playing enough minutes to get that 34 30 37 so give me some lowry here all right uh might not be the lower of the past but he still can get to 32 40 plus 40 can discipline that is possible uh second i can still go with uh hero if i want but let's see let me check the heart real quick how this 5.9 i wish 34 uh play 36 40 he's playing the minutes man and that's and who they are playing they play in Denver. Mm. Yeah, I'm hero man. He started so great last game. I'm just not sure. For some reason, they don't like pricing him up. So 30, 27. I mean, he started hot. Hot. Why you only play 22 minutes? Huh? I'm not sure what happened. Let's see if they say anything here. Uh, 14 points, get the bounds, two, two, eight shots in the contest, converting half. He also went 5 for 5 from the line to finish with 14 points, and he made an impact on the other areas as well. But why play only 22 minutes, though? That's worried me a little bit. Because I do want to play him as a coach. So I'm just going to go ahead and go with Edwards, man. Problem with Edwards, man. So many players there, too. So many players. But he averaged 37. Uh, he went up this game. I think Edwards basically the best player on the team right now. Uh, so I'm going to go. Who, let's see. Who many Spurs? Uh, hopefully that's on the blowout. I'm going to go with Edwards. He's at 7.4K. Uh, so my choice was between him, Lowry, or Hart. But I'm gonna go with him here, and basically you can do whatever you want. All right, so for the star, he doesn't have to be a player that's 10k. But if you wanna play any of those guys, you can and Bay, Charge, and Tatum. So I'm gonna give you somebody even cheaper. Uh, I'm gonna go with uh, yeah. So let's do it. Let's go small forward, Jimmy Butler, 8.3k. He's at the cheapest he's been. It's 34, not good. 36, 42. I'm gonna go with Jimmy Butler here. Uh, I'm gonna go with Jimmy Butler here. Uh, as because I think I'm I'm gonna try to make most of my lineup without having a 10k guy. I mean, a, well, no, I have, because I do like uh, where are they? Ja. KD, I do like those guys, even James Harden, so it'll be hard. So, oh, if you don't want to play him, then you can just go ahead and take him out and put, uh, I mean, if you go by average, you get, uh, what is it, 8.5K, Tyus Halliburton, if you want to go with him. 
or you can go with Lillard. All right. So who Lillard playing? Denver and Lillard was, and you got Lowry Martin, and I'm so happy for him. Man, I thought that's what he was gonna do last year, but never had the chance. So at 7.6k, huh? Against Houston too, possibly gonna go up. So I'm gonna go and, and just give you guys Lowry Martin right here. Do I mean that's wait a second. That's my three call. I miss somebody. Yeah. So that's not even my star yet. I'm tripping here. I only give you guys three guys. All right. So let's go ahead and put uh, back to easy to power forward. And then let's go back to small forward and put Levine 7.2 km. That's a great price. All right, so I'm going to do it this way. Those are the five players I'm giving you guys. I'll give you guys a lot of money to do whatever you want. You can add the most expensive players if you want. Let's say if you add uh, the most expensive player, how much you're going to have left? Uh, 11.2. Oh, they got him only as center. All right, so you can move Kelly O to power forward and then put him as center. So let's, but me, I'm not playing him. So that you can just move him here if you want and then put him as center, for example. Then you will have 5.1 left, but yeah, I'm not doing that. All right, so that's the five players I'm giving you guys. I'm giving you guys Laurie Edwards, Jimmy Butler, Laurie Markinen, and Kelly O. All right, guys, appreciate you guys again. Subscribe, turn on your bell notification, and drop a like in this video for me. And uh, I'm out. Oh, by the way, hopefully you guys had a great time uh, winning some money in football or basketball.